Matekwe did what I thought was most ignoble. I'd known Amakta Kwe as a very disciplined person, as a, a person who was not a liar, not a thief, a man who commanded a lot of respect, a very dedicated person. And um, for him to have been engaged in the misuse of soldiers, to do what he did when we came into office, Say with respect, if I could draw you uh -uh, back. I don't. I'm building it up. The trial of the coup plotters was very revealing. People were tortured, and they, how can you try our generals and the top brass within minutes and then say they are guilty, sentenced to death? When the jailbreak came, uh, the June 19th jailbreak, yeah. they came out, Tepo and I think another person, they took part in another coup. They said they were carrying out instructions. Yeah. That was their defense, that they felt that they were carrying out state instructions. I went and called my husband that uh, is being wanted by someone. No, Ben. No, sir. Bamba camp. When he came, he was told that he was dead at uh, Bamba camp. Oh, so Bamba camp. When can you tell us that you want to be Bamba camp? He has the color. What he was going to do at Bamba camp? Let me be an unsung couple. Oh, by then my uh, my husband was uh, barefooted. No, my cousin. My mom found something since some man they unshare. What's the daddy? I asked that uh, I should give him some sandals to put on. He said no. No, but what's a person? And then the fellow drew a pistol. This is a, an outrageous claim. It's completely outrageous. There is this talk that the National Reconciliation Commission report it stated yeah. that you were actually supposed to have a recording yeah. of Amate Kwe, who was alleged to have actually led the killing of these three judges in 82. Yeah. They said your recording never happened. No, they didn't say that. I told the committee mm -hmm. that the person who gave me the recorder, it was, those days it was one of these... That's flight lieutenant George Rollins. Well, I don't remember, but let me tell the story. Okay. Yes, the person who gave me the recorder, the recorder was very innovative and you know about that time it was uh, voice activated you know mm -hmm. yeah and uh, it was new and uh, by the time you finished with that with, with, with the proceedings and i checked it are not recorded it are not recorded yeah but thank god uh i went was talked to when he was tied to the sticks and he said the same thing that that he told me. and that recording was done by former president Rollins. I just got rushed up to my father's bedroom to go and tell him what has happened. It's, I got to the bedroom, he wasn't there. I was, so I went to my mother's room, I said, this is daddy. Uh, she said, should be asleep, so she's not there. And I went downstairs and the food remained the same way he left it. For the past 20 years, I have been living under the pain of having these allegations made against me year in, year out. Who killed the judges? A Joy News special assignment on crimes that shook the nation. Tuesday, 2nd October 2018 on Joy News TV, Joy FM, Adam TV, Adam FM and online at myjoyonline.com and multitvworld.com. Who killed the judges?